A Charleston County deputy has been fired after documents from the sheriff's office show he was involved in an assault after a car chase. And now he's under investigation by state police over use of force allegations. Live 5's Michael Higdon joins us from the first alert desk and tells us more of what we know right now, Michael. Rough and sheriff's office officials say Deputy James Carter was fired because of an incident on October the 21st. Sheriff Kristen Graziano said in a statement that it was an easy decision to fire Carter after reviewing the body camera video of the incident. Carter's termination letter states body camera footage of the incident confirms Carter's involvement in serious policy violation and that his actions quote warrant immediate termination for egregious conduct. Graziano says they have started an internal investigation into both Carter's conduct and his supervisor, Sergeant Tim Carroll. Carroll has been placed on administrative leave with pay during this investigation. State Law Enforcement Division says that they were requested on November the 8th to investigate the claims of use of force. The Sheriff's Office explained the process took some time because Sergeant Carroll turned Carter's use of force packet over to the patrol captain, who then alerted the Office of Professional Standards, which reviewed the footage and notified command staff. Carter's term termination letter says he violated three different policies, including employees that should conduct themselves in a manner to reflect most favorably of the sheriff's office and employees that shall obey all laws of the United States. Carter has five business days to appeal his termination with the Thanksgiving holiday next week, though the sheriff's office says he has until the end of the day on November 28th to file any grievance at the alert desk. I'm Michael Higdon.